Alright guys, we're back for another Dokkan Battle video. Let's just jump right in. We got Goat Yu here. We're going to go ahead and take a look at the LR Ginyu Force. The Beast Gohan fight is a very particular fight in which I think even AGL Ginyu, we could make some noise. Because at the end, we know where the super attack is. So I think AGL Ginyu could work here. Alright, so we got the LR Ginyu Force turn 1, which is just like perfect for us. Um, by getting the LR Ginyu Force turn 1, remember, we're going to be able to line them up for turn 5 of their active skill. And they have, I mean, I, I'm, I'm hesitant to call it the best active skill in the game because we know how good like Beasts is, Orange Piccolo, Ribrian. Like there's a bunch of characters that have really busted actives. But, like, the Ginyu Force, it, just a huge permanent buff to the entire team. It's just, in, it's insane. It's crazy. I, like, I, it's so good. And I, I guess they were very comfortable doing it because it's restricted to the special pose team, right? And even, you could do it earlier on the Ginyu Force team, but, it, you know, that's still a special pose team, right? So, uh, yeah, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. All right, let's go ahead and jump in. Um, let Ginyu, uh, go ahead and do his domination and stuff like that. Uh, and we'll see how we're gonna do here. Um, AGL Ginyu. Uh, the, the, the only thing about AGL Ginyu that could be really bad. See, like, running the team like this, opening rotations just make things scary. Huh. Ah, uh, damn, dude. Damn, damn, damn. Damn, damn, damn. What do I do with Ginyu, man? We're gonna have Ginyu on turn 5 with zero stacks. I just... It's... <sighs> We're gonna have Ginyu on turn 5 with zero stacks, man. I, I, you know, I can't... I can't do anything about it! What, what am I supposed to do? Like, I gotta get him next to the LR Ginyu. Okay, don't super... Okay, good. Okay, good. Remember that the Gammas are bad. As, like, the second the Gamma show up, they're bad. You know, once we get a couple of attacks in, you know, then quickly that's a race. They're very good. Uh, hopefully we don't get some crits or we get normals or something like that. Maybe Ginyu will actually get supers here. Oh, yeah, that's perfect. Yes, 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 yes. Perfect, perfect. All right, they have their damage reduction up. Gohan wouldn't even really be able to crush them. Uh, Gotenks would get obliterated by a super attack. So hopefully he just... Is in a dodging mood for the super. Uh, Ginyu. Might get one shot if he's super here. It'll be close. Normal. Oh, dude, I thought that was... I thought, I thought that was Gohan super. In. I don't... I mean, at a certain point, like, you run AGL Ginyu, and then the boss, okay, snipes your ass in slot three. Like, it's not much you can do with that. You just... Throw your hands up and say, thanks for pounding my asshole, bud. Uh, yeah, this is fine. Next turn, we'll float off Goat Ma 1. Uh, right away, we, we had Gamma 1 pretty much get um, fully built up turn 1, which is nice. Uh, remember that the LR Ginyu Force, I mean, we don't have to worry about them uh, in terms of like traditional like type advantage and type disadvantage. On the special pose team, they're always going to be guarding. They're always going to be super effective uh, against all types at minimum. Always. So we're always going to have them not really, you know, stuck against, like, you know, type advantage or type disadvantage at any point. Uh, and then just keeping the Ginyu Force around, you know, the rest of the team was just the stats are going to be... 13? I said for game one? Damn. At Topo supporting, Ginyu Force supporting... Remember, this is turn three, so the Ginyu Force, I mean, they had their passive support, intro support was still up for this turn, and then their 18 key super attack effects support. 
So that's I think that might that's like the highest I've ever seen Game One's attack stat right there. But I mean that's the Ginyu Force variant of this team is gonna be like that. We're gonna see a lot of like, oh, that's one of the highest I've seen, or blah 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 blah. Uh, how are we feeling right here? We'll float off God Topo, yeah. I was gonna um float off Go Tanks, but we could do God Topo. They got 50% damage reduction right away, so we're fine there. We'll do that. And then Topo, God Topo will come back for us in slot one, ready to tank. Now, the Ginyu Force, I I mean, we could put him in slot one and see, I guess, if it comes to that. I'm not dying to do that, though. To be like, oh, we gotta get the Ginyu Force in front of the super attack. Unfortunately, the Ginyu Force is not top-level defense of that nature where we put them up against the 3 million damage super attacks. They're not on that level defensively, unfortunately. Um, they're more so just buffing the entire team. Like, they, you know, they have uh, essentially the same role as LR Bulma right now. I Like, that's... I, I mean, if I said the Ginyu Force is around LR Bulma level, I think they're better than Bulma, of course. But, like, that's kind of... Like, they're, like, a slightly better version of Bulma, I think is what the Ginyu Force is right now. Um, only difference that Bulma Rainbow Orb changes as well, which is super good. Uh, but the Ginyu Force's support, is, it, it ha you gotta say it's better, right? Especially with that act. Once the active comes in, oh, yeah. And, uh, remember, Bulma's active is turn 7. Whereas the Ginyu Force, it, I mean, it'll be turn 7 if you start in slot 7 on turn 3, but... I mean, in this particular run, they were, you know, turn one, which means we have it right away. Uh, this is bad, dude. Dude, I, I can't, like, I, I've tried my best, guys, to run EGL Ginyu when I can, but, like, it's just... Uh, bro. Dude. <laughs> How could you not love him? All right, I, we're probably gonna get killed. I I think Gohan is supering either in slot one or slot two. Tell me where he's supering. Like, go ahead, say with confidence he's supering in slot one. I I don't think in you can live. Gohan Gohan hits too hard, but he's close to two million. Gohan is. Uh, we'll put LR Ginyu Force in slot one because on their 18 key super attack effect they're giving a defensive buff. I mean, as long as we don't have to eat a super attack from Gohan right here on Ginyu, like, I like I feel like this is a comfortable win. Like, we're just going to comfortably win as long as Ginyu doesn't get sniped right here. All right, we got gold, though, which isn't the extra attack. Nah, there's no way, dude. Like, I... Okay, sure. <sighs> okay. I <laughs> man. Man. Oh. Woo. <clears throat> I was ready. I was ready for us to just get sniped out of there. I was so ready for it. No? Super attack. Do we want to float off Topo? Or Gotenks? Probably safer to float off Topo. I think I'll float off Topo. Because it just flat out would be safer to do. Uh, here, let's go ahead and drop the Gamma standby. We'll go ahead and finish Gohan off. There we go. So we have LR Gamma 1 ready. Perfect, perfect. Alright, so now we have God Topo lined up for turn 1. Let's see what it looks like. Ginyu locked in slot 3. Do you guys want me to put him in slot 1? LR Ginyu for us? I can. I think Ginyu... Oh, I, I don't know if... Uh, like, I think EGL Ginyu 
With a. Uh, because Beast is surely gonna super. I'll do this just because, like, we need to see. I think. Uh, oh. Uh, no, we don't need to. Um. I will turn into God Topo. No. No, I won't. Because, well, Topo is giving support. Let's just do this. The point, we we, we want to see how Ginyu does, right? Like, this is not, like, in terms of winning, this is not going to work. Because Topo is not going to be guarding in slot 2. Ginyu, you know, we want his links up. The the way to win this, that like, in, if, if the, our goal is to win, God Topo slot 1, LR Ginyu 4 slot 2 is what we do right here. But I do have a dodge build. We could dodge. We don't. All right, let's see. Active up. I mean, Ginyu support, Topo support. Yeah, I mean, you know, that's not... Okay. I I don't know that we could really... That's pretty good. Yeah, okay. Maybe they're a bit better than I was giving them credit for. I mean, this is a this is a very juiced up turn. We're still dead, but... Oh, Topo's double digits right there? Okay. I don't know how Ginyu's gonna do, because we didn't get the 18 key super attack effect. Normal, of course. Of course. Of course. Yep. Zero. Okay. I don't know how Ginyu's gonna take this. Okay. I mean, we easily could have lived, right? Like, uh, Beast, Supers, Ginyu, stuns him. That's why Dodge is just very good for these bosses. Because those nasty super attack effects... We can avoid them. I I mean that's that that that's very easy to win. I, I'm pretty content. I feel like that, like we saw what we needed to see. They ate that a little bit better than I was expecting. Actually, I thought we were gonna take more damage than that. Again, remember how good the situation was. Um, base Topo is supporting, right? So we had his support up, and Ginyu, remember, does support as well in base. So his support was up, you know, and we had them, you know, their damage reduction was up before they attack. Active skill was up. All that was up. Yeah, I don't know. I, I think they're a bit better than I was giving them credit for. I, yeah. I think that w what they are, is there a better version of Bulma that's restricted to one category? I do think is a good way to describe this character. Um, that's not a terrible thing. Like, I would like to see more characters like this. 430 from Beast Super Attack is really good. I remember, that's one of the super attacks where, you know, you, you, you can hear people crying and say, Oh, this is good. Yeah, it is, actually. With these 3 million damage, like, bosses that are approaching 3 million damage and shit like that. When you live, that's good. It doesn't really matter any deeper than that. You live... It's a W, period. So, like, the Ginyu... And they lived with a fair amount of HP to spare, too. That was pretty good. This this run made me feel a lot better about this character. That was nice. That was good. That was good.